Today we're reporting 2,903 new cases. This is the largest number of new cases we have ever reported. And today's reported cases brings the total number of people who have tested positive for COVID-19 in LA County to over 100,000 people. It's actually at 100,772. 100, there are currently 1,710 people who have confirmed cases of COVID-19 and are hospitalized. This also is the highest number of hospitalizations that we are reporting uh, for many, many weeks, uh, over many, many weeks. 26% of the people who are hospitalized are now in the ICU, and 17% of the people who are hospitalized are on ventilators. I'm sad to report 22 additional people passed away from COVID-19. The total number of deaths to 3,326. We do have data demonstrating that there have been gaps in compliance with directives amongst businesses. As businesses have reopened, the most common complaints we've received are around businesses not posting uh, and completing the infection control protocols, not requiring face coverings for either employees and or when appropriate for patrons, and not enforcing physical distancing for employees and customers. Our inspectors provided 65% of the retail establishments they visited with the protocols because most businesses were not in compliance, and they provided 83% of the restaurants that they visited with protocols also because they were struggling to be in compliance. But this past weekend, three weekends after our res restaurants have been open, 33% of the restaurants were still not able to adhere to the physical distancing protocols indoors. And 44% of the restaurants had workers who were not wearing face coverings and face shields. For the bars that newly had reopened this past weekend, 49% of the bars were not adhering to physical distancing protocols indoors, and fully 54% uh, of the bars did not have their workers wearing face coverings and or face shields. Yesterday, Governor Gavin Newsom announced the closure of bars in seven counties throughout California, including Los Angeles County. The LA County Health Order, Officer Order has been amended to require all bars, breweries, pubs, wineries, and tasting rooms to close unless they offer meals. This includes closing bar areas in all restaurants. The state considers this necessary to slow the recent spread of the coronavirus across our region. 